So, using the sound ah, uh, we are now going to move into a more advanced form of ah, uh, and that is embedding the sound ah uh, in arakara. Arakara is a very popular mantra that Dr. Pillai has been teaching for many years. And so many people around the world have felt the beneficial effects of this mantra. It's a mantra that Dr. Pillai refers to as an impossibility buster. With Arakara, nothing is impossible. And I'm going to explain to you why these small syllable sounds hold this energy of manifest manifestation and manifesting anything that you need in your life. Now if we break down arakara into the syllables here, first we have a, ah, and we learned that a ah is the energy of conception. And in this situation, we're working on conception of an idea into physical reality. The second syllable, ra, is a fire energy. And fire is a greatly transforming energy. It can change a sand into gold or diamond. And those of you that come from India, you know about the fire ritual. It's considered the most important ritual for carrying our prayers to divine beings that can help us to manifest things in our life. Fire is a very powerful transforming energy that can transmute one form of energy into another. Then we have the syllable ka. Ka is the first principle of materiality. Then again we end with ra, the fire energy. So when we move from a, ra, ka, ra, we're moving from a conception of an idea, empowering it with fire energy to transform that idea into materiality. It's a very simple process. We take an idea and use fire to transform the idea into a person, a place, an object, a situation, an event, or an opportunity in our life. Now what we're going to do now is that you need to have this sound implanted within you in a deeper way. So first we're going to chant the sound that will penetrate the sound at the first superficial level of your hearing consciousness. And then I'm going to lead you through a brief meditation where we'll implant the mantra on a deeper, more profound level where the mantra can do its work. And the beautiful thing about quantum sounds is that they have the power locked in the sound. Even if you didn't understand the meaning of arakara, and if you chanted all throughout the day, arakara, 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 better yet, if you kept chanting arakara and thinking of what you wanted to manifest, it would work. The sound, this quantum sound, has the full potential to uh, be an impossibility buster and do anything that you need it to do. So this sound, will do its work for you without you having to understand the process. All you do is repeat the sound. So I'm going to walk you through the process now.